Hello, folks. This is Lindsey Hellison with Sports Psychology Solutions back in the building. We're at the University of Michigan Dearborn uh, here for the Inside Prep Sport Fall Super Showcase put on by none other than Mr. T. Jake Kelly. Now, while you may hear him in the background talking to the players as we wrap up about basketball skills, he's had a great coaching staff here helping. We're also here talking about media training. That's right, preparing our young people to be able to go on and get in front of the camera. Who knows, Jakari may be the player of the game after a game and has to talk. He may have a goal to go on and play at a higher level in sports, and I've been told with the college campuses I've been on that they do not do this as far as the media training. May want to be a sports broadcaster or just want to be a better public speaker. So with that being said, what we've been sharing to young people is things like controlling that nervous energy. In this case, I'm not sensing this from you. You seem to be holding your ground, which is good. What I really tell a lot of basketball players is you should act like you're taking the charge so you can just stand there and that way you know when you move, what happens is a foul, right? So you want to stay locked in. That tells me if you play defense a lot, I guess you play some defense. You're good. How you doing, man? I'm doing well. You represent from the Grand Rapids West Side of the State, right? Yes, sir. Great. Now, what school are you at? Godwin Heights High School. Oh, yeah. That's been known to be a very um, serious program when it comes to basketball and things like that. I think I interviewed your coach. Did you guys come to Lansing for the money ball? Um, uh, it was like a money ball tournament like a year ago? No. Okay. What grade are you in now? Uh, going in the ninth. Ninth. That's probably why. I think they did come down. You probably weren't there. So um, what have you gotten from this showcase today that you think could be helpful for you? Uh, a lot of competition. Uh, great defense, which makes a person better when they have to get past the defender more quicker. So that's what I learned from this camp. Okay, very good. What does it feel like being a freshman, you know, jumping into a program? Are you doing JV or varsity? Uh, I'll be playing varsity. Uh, uh, a lot of the guys on the team respect me and they push me to, to go harder even when I don't believe in myself. So even being a freshman, they should respect me as like I'm a junior or senior. So it's uh, a great family at Godwin. Yeah, yeah. It's interesting, man. You can't, probably going to get a little bit of hate and jealousy because you're a freshman playing varsity. Is that possible? Yeah, it could be possible, but I just got to push through that and not worry about it and stay on the path that I got to be on. That's a great thing. Uh, on a personal note, you seem to have a lot of support. I got a text from somebody all the way in Miami, Ira Childress. You know, uh, athletic director down at Gulliver Prep, you know, was saying, hey, look out for this guy. He's going to be here. You got your parents here. seem to be real supportive of you. So you're a very fortunate young man. You got a lot of people behind you. Do you do you feel that? Yeah, I feel a lot of it. I mean, a lot of my friends say I have a very good supporting cast when I go all over the country and play against the best. So I feel like my family, they uh, sacrifice a lot for me to do what I do. That's good. That's good. And that's not about being pressured, but knowing you got good things happening. So um, what's something that your incoming teammates, may know about you that the rest of the world doesn't that you can share right now? Uh, that I love basketball. Like, a lot of people don't understand. I write in my room. Uh, I want to go to the NBA, and I'm just a very hard worker. I, I don't have no no chill to get to where I want to get to, so I just work my hardest as I can. Okay, well, I'm going to tell you this right now. As a sports psychology consultant, if you're that committed right now, uh, what you really want to focus on doing is being able to block out people who can't be as committed as you are. Because normally when you're at this age, people, you know, aren't really ready to make that kind of commitment. Uh, people will try to dissuade you from your dreams. But you seem to be committed as you talk to me. You got a great supporting cast. So this is going to tell you early on, some people may not be able to go on a ride with you. That makes sense? Mm, yes, sir. Okay. Well, with that, I want to keep you. I think you did an excellent job. You had great presence here. Uh, you represented well. So we want to wish you the best of luck, okay? Thank you. All right. We'll see you, man. Good job. Thank you.